Good morning and welcome to my channel. Uh, sorry about the wind. But here I'm going to do a little bit of rock fishing today. Uh, here at Upper Dower Lighthouse, you can see it. And well, forecast is mixed. Got some sunshine over there and some clouds coming over there. Uh, it's about a medium tide, which is perfect for this mark. Uh, let me just show you. Uh, yeah, thank you for tuning in, and hopefully, we're going to catch something today. I only ever blink here once, and that was on uh, spring tide, where waves and the swell was so rough it just pushed the gear into the snags and uh, lost five five rigs and I didn't get that but apart from that every time I came here I've got some codlings rass even a conga here I haven't landed one yet but I had them on <laughs> so yeah and I hope you had a, a very wonderful Christmas and I wish you all a happy new year and hopefully next year we catch many more fish so yeah i'm gonna get you through my my setup and baits and then yeah i'll sh show you some surroundings in a minute as i say we got abadawa lighthouse here and over just around the corner is the abadawa silver sands over there's black sands there's the gas station where they fill up the ships uh, Edinburgh over there, and then we carry on with Bird Island and up towards Kikori. So yeah, let me let me get set up before I get it too cold. It's about zero degrees, and uh, we're going to fish up to about high tide, which is about half past one. So there's a bit of bit of swell. That's good. Hopefully we're going to get a codling. That's the main target species today. This is a trident pulley rig. You can see the links. Yeah, and the, the business end, we're going to use a 4-0 circle ka uh, kaiki hook. Very strong hooks. And on the top, a 3-0 Aberdeen style. So in about 5 ounce lead. And we use 40 pounds braid, 50 pounds shock leader, and we're just going to go down there. Not very far, maybe 50 yards. So let's get it chucked out and then we'll see as we go along. The second rig, I just use a, a very plain uh, rock bottom rig. Uh, if I can untangle this one, yeah, it's just 50 pound main line and 20 pound breakaway with a four ounce uh, lead, three or hook, and I just put some floating beads and some just some mackerel and rag. So. Let's get it out very close and see what we can catch there. Alright, stay tuned. No, no bites on the other road yet. Yeah, it's cold today. I feel like a southwest westerly wind. The wind should be. Some 
got any other fish, especially the blank. Have a coffee. Have a coffee. Coffee and a snack. No, no real bites. I want to mention uh, try to pull At the moment, it's working absolutely spot on as how it's supposed to work. I never had any issues with it. I think it's fun, but I'll try. <laughs> uh, it's wrong, yes. Just want to test the with the fish on. Let's wait and see what happens today. But if you don't go out and try, you're never going to find out. So they're expecting bites to pick up in the last two hours of the high tide. So I haven't got any worms with me today. I, I, I can't get any in the moment. Let's see what happens. Yeah, I just take one of the smaller baits, untouched, and I just send it back out. But I just made another sausage and uh, with a razor. And mussels in the bottom. We got uh, four kaiki extra wide, and at the top uh, three old Aberdeen. Ready uh, for the next cast. Here's another close up from the rock bottom rig. It's 50 pounds, 20 pounds breakaway, 4 ounce bomb net, and a 3 0 hook with floating beads. And I've got some, uh, some old preserved rag with a buoy. Ready? Ready to go out? Oh, a cold, cold wind. Oh my! I'm sure we're going to catch something. There are just an update. No bike yet. Yeah,
Jason. Yeah, I got the event. Uh, the camera doesn't stand <laughs> here. Nothing happening. But it's just come out. Ah, come on. Yeah, I just got a bite. Oh, it's just blow the weed. Hold your arm just to load the weed. Yeah, still nothing. I'll give it another half an hour and then I'm just going to pick up. Sunshine or whatever, I, I don't know. Or the cotton is not coming in. anything else I'll put it on the end if not then uh, say goodbye for now thank you for watching and uh, yeah the trial I only lost one one hook on the trial and rig got snagged for a new one on and be back up in fishing. Uh, yeah but that is that's how it goes sometimes. You go out fishing and one day you catch and the next day you don't. So the day might be the day maybe you don't catch. All the beds came back, I touched not even cry back to the Yeah, thanks for watching and uh, till next time. See you later.